This is a spiritual warfare. And it starts in your mind. Once you change the mind, because we got brothers that been out, been out in the streets. They done been there and done that. But they changed their mindset. Right. They got their mind together. Right. We ain't out here for a food drive. We ain't out here for a charity event. We are here to change your mind. What's your name? My name is Trucky. 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 I'm Jazz. Like you saying, you got a like you said, you got a, a girlfriend. But you see a lot of uh, men out here that have more than one girlfriend, or they just got a girlfriend, or just sleeping around, right? We're not marrying our women. My my question to you is, you say you can catch something out here. That's uh, the black community is rampant in diseases. Right? Chlamydia, herpes. You got the walk, you walking around with the claps. You don't know who got what. We all look normal. We all look normal. But now, what else can happen? What else can happen? What, what's some other consequences of just of sleeping around with different women? What's some other consequences? I mean, it's a lot. You can get into like, you can end up dead, because depending on who you're messing with. Hey, you know, I like that. I see a lot of videos like that, bro. These girls out here is thotting. That's right. And they, uh, yeah, right. they, they call them, they call them, what do they call them now? 304s. They call them 304s. I really don't know them. I think it's uh, holes spelled backwards anyway. But anyway, they call them 304s now. So the thing is, you got a boy, say you got a uh, you got a girl, but then she, or, or you see a girl, she bad. She, You know she got a man, but you end up, you say, look, I'm gonna creep with her anyway. You creep with her, you go to, you creep with her at his crib. You go to his, you go to his crib. He come home, he come home, and he see you in the bed with her. We see this, this is normal, man. This is this is normal on live. You see it on Facebook live, you see it on TikTok. Brother take out his phone, he recording, yo, get out my house, you who this? And you see the brother talking back to the boy, the boy, he in his crib. The brother like, yo, man, I'm that, I see one brother, he said, man, I'm that nigga. <laughs> and the, he in another man's house telling him I'm that nigga. You understand, but the thing is, you can get killed. Messing around. Now, what about child support? That too. That's if you get kids, you got kids. That's another thing. Yo, child support is killing the black man. The black right. man, right? Killing everything. That's a pocket. Right. Like at least eighty percent of our black uh, uh, brothers is, is on child support. Right, right. Understand that? They is on child support. I'm talking about money. I'm talking about eight hundred, maybe nine hundred, fifteen hundred coming out checks. You can't even eat. But these are the consequences of what? These are the consequences of sleeping around. Right. These are the consequences of, of messing around with different women because we're not marrying our women. All right? Read that again. All right, bro. Hebrews chapter 5. Go ahead. Hebrews 13 and 4. Read. Marriage is honorable in all. Uh -huh. In the bed and the fire. But whoremongers and adulterers God will judge. Now, in the city of Philadelphia, whoremongering is at an all-time rate. That's right. All-time high. Why? Because how are we taught to become whoremongers? We taught from the older generation. Right. Why? Because daddy was a rolling stone. He was a player. Right? So now, we, as you growing up, you want to be like who? You want to be like dad. You want to be like the neighborhood player in the, in the, in the, in the neighborhood. Right. You want to grow up and be like him. He's getting all the women. You're like, damn, that's what I want to do. You see rappers on TV. They got the baddest Jones in their videos. Right. They shaking it behind, they twerking all over the place. They got the bad video fixings. Okay, you say, yo, I want that too. That's why the whoremongering starts. And they watered down the term for whoremongering. And whoremongering, we know it as what? Becoming a player. We thought that was how you become a man. Right. Like, yo, that, yo, you got how many? Yo, he the man. My man, you got seven? 
You got three joints you talking to at one time? Damn, yo, you doing it. You the man, bro. But read that again. What did God say? Marriage is honorable at all, uh -huh. and the bed and the file. But whoremongers and adulterers, God will judge. Bring it out. God is going to judge that whoremonger, that man that's promiscuous, that woman that's promiscuous. Right. He's going to judge you. That adulterer, that woman that's stepping outside of marriage, that man that's stepping outside of that marriage. Right. And that's normal in the black community. That's normal. Right. You understand? It's normal for a man to step out of his marriage. You see, like I said, you see it all over TV. You see it all over social media. Right. It's on social media, man. This is rampant in the black community. Right. God said a man and a woman will be judged for that thing. Give me, uh, how, how can you be judged? Give me that. Deuteronomy 28, 68. How can you be judged? Deuteronomy chapter 28 and verse 61. Man, this smell like the whole, this whole, this whole uh, block smoking weed out here. Go ahead. Also, every sickness and every plague, uh -huh. which is not written in the book of this law. Every disease, every sickness and every plague that's not in the Bible. What's some sicknesses and what's some plagues that's not in the Bible? You got, you got herpes, gonorrhea. Right. They got super gonorrhea now. That thing eating through the condoms. Damn. I remember they said it's untreatable. You just gonna burn, you just gonna burn with that thing. Super gonorrhea, read on. Uh, and uh, read that part again. Also, every sickness. And every plague, uh -huh. which is not written in the book of this law. Every disease that's not written in the book of this law, that's not written in the Bible, God says he's going to bring upon that adulterer and that whoremonger. Right. right. Now, let's do some statistics in the black community. Wake them up. Maybe here in Frankfurt. We're, we're the, uh, in, the, in the black community in the U.S., we're the leading, we're leading in HIV. Right. We're high in statistics in chlamydia. We're high in statistics in herpes. Right. Syphilis. When you look at the other, when you when you do the stats, when you do the stats, they um I know sometimes they have a map and they show they show like the red and they show the different the uh the colors, the red, light red, and they got the lighter red. And, you know? and in city in cities like Philadelphia, uh North New Jersey, Camden, LA. The black community is in the red for HIV. We're in the red for that thing. Wake them up. Bring it on. In the black and Latin community, HIV is rampant in the black community, in the Latin community. Why? Because we're whoremongering and we're becoming promiscuous. Right. That's all that's being pushed throughout the social media. That's all that's being pushed throughout three TV. Right. That's all you see. Right? Give me your evil communication. All you see on social media and TV is a big booty bouncing up and down. Oh, that's all you see, which is causing what? It's causing the whoremongering. It's causing the adultery. And it starts here in your mind with TV. That's right. Read that. First Corinthians chapter 15 and verse 33. Read. Be not deceived. Hey, the Bible says don't be deceived. A lot of people deceived out here. A lot of people deceived. Right. Okay, we all we all been there. We've been we us we've been deceived also. Right. Free evil communication. What? Evil communication. Say it again. Evil communication. Evil communication. What is some outlets of communication that is evil? Like I said, you have your Facebook, you have your TikTok. Okay, you have your um Instagram. Instagram. Oh, Instagram is the worst. Instagram is the worst. Okay? These are the evil communications. You still got your videos, YouTube. So you still got your videos that's coming out. You got your Cardi B's, your Nicki Minaj's, your, your Megan Thee Stallions. And guess what? You, you know what's so funny about Cardi B? She won't let her daughter watch what she rap about. Wake them up. She, she says she's not gonna let her daughter watch what she rap about. Isn't that some type of hypocrisy? Meaning what? She's deceiving, she's been brought up to deceive the people. And she knows she's deceiving the people. She said, look, what I'm doing, you're not gonna, you're not gonna take part in that. That's what Cardi B said. Right. 
Young Jeezy. Young Jeezy sent his son to a, a, a private school, a prep school. Bring it out. You got rappers whose sons there graduating, man. Uh, Busta Rhymes' son, he went, he graduated. I think from college. Mm, bring it out. But that's not what they rapping about. They telling you to kill each other. Right. That's what's in the lyrics. Kill, 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 kill. And the city of Philadelphia is high in murder. Right. right. The murder rate is outrageous out here. Bring it out. You know why? Because of the evil communication that we're listening to. And you know how? It starts in your mind. You may see your brother, he listen, he got headphones on, and he, all he doing is he making a, a gun with his hand. Why? Because of the music. The drill music. So as he's walking, he, he, he making the sounds, everything. He got the everything going on. Because why? It starts in your mind. Give me, hold that, give me Mark uh, 721. It all starts in the mind. And I, mean, I know y'all may say, yo, what are y'all doing for the community? Y'all out here, y'all ain't doing nothing for the community. Well, let me tell you, we changing the minds of our people. That's right. That's where it starts at. Right. right. What I'm going to do, I'm going to have a gun drive, I'm going to have a food drive. I ain't going to do nothing. All you're going to do is get mad at another brother and go buy another gun. Right. So what are that doing for the community? So we ain't out here with that. Why? Because we understand that our, uh, this is a spiritual warfare. And it starts in your mind. Once you change the mind, because we got brothers that been out, been out in the streets. They done been there and done that. But they changed their mindset. That's right. They got their mind together. Right. We ain't out here for a food drive. We ain't out here for a charity event. We are here to change your mind. Read Mark 7 and verse 21. Read it. For from within, out of the heart of men. From the heart meaning what? Your mind. Hold that to prove that. Give me Genesis 6. Bring it out. To prove it out. that the heart is your mind. Right. We may ask a brother or sister, yo, where's your heart at? And they, they point to your, your, uh, your uh, heart in your um, that pumps blood. Right. That just pumps blood for you. When the Bible speaks about your heart, it's referring to your mind. Watch this. Read Genesis, you know Gen what? Genesis chapter 6 and verse 5. Yes. Bring it yes, out. bring that. And God saw that the wickedness of man was great in the earth, uh -huh. and that every imagination of his of the thoughts of his heart. Read it was, right. Read it clear. And read God clear. saw that the wickedness of man was great in the earth, uh -huh. and that every imagination of the thoughts of his, of his heart, and every imagination of the thoughts, the thoughts of his heart, letting you know where your thoughts come from, your mind. Right. That's where your thoughts come from. Your thoughts don't come from your chest. They come from your mind. Right. Bring it out. Go back. Read. Mark chapter 7 and verse 21. Uh -huh. For from within, out of the heart of men, proceed evil thoughts. Out of the, listen, Jesus the Christ, the black Messiah said, out of the heart, out of the mind of men, comes evil thoughts. Right. In your everyday life, you're thinking about doing evil. Right. Read. Adulteries. Adulteries is in the is in the mind of the black and Latin man, the black woman, the Latin woman. Go ahead. Fornication. Fornication. Sleeping around. Outside Bring. of marriage. Bring it out. Sexual immorality is in the mind of the black and Latin community. Bestiality. Sleeping around with animals. Yes, that happens. Pedophilia is rampant. Men like the little kids. Women may like little kids. The molestations in the black community. This is all uh, dealing with fornication. Homosexuality. Having a threesome. Bring it out. Incest. All of these things is rampant in the black community. Right. Right. It may be kept on the low, but it's happening. And there is a God to judge you for that thing. Right. Read on. Murder. Murder is the number one thing on the on the in the, in the uh, on the list for Philadelphia. As soon as you turn the news, there's a murder or uh, or uh, uh, something happening. Right. right. Why? Evil communication. Why? Because we don't see God in one another. We don't see that black image of Jesus Christ in one another. We don't see that black image of, 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 of God in one another. That's why we shoot each other. We kill each other. We look at each other sideways. 
Just walking down the street, I can't even say what up to my brother, man. I can't even say what up to him. He got attitude. He woke up on the wrong side of the bed, so if I say, yo, what's up, bro? Yo, 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 whoa, yo, 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 watch your mouth. Like, damn, bro, I just said, I just said what's up? I'm asking you, how you doing? I'm just, how you doing? But we don't do that. But bro. guess what? The white man come walk through this hood. Yo, hey, how you doing, sir? Wake him up. Nobody questions him being in the hood. Why, why is he around here? Why? Because we don't stick together. Right. We don't come together to, 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 to for each other out here. Right. Nobody stick together, man. Right. That's right. That's right. The black and Latin man, the black community don't stick together for nothing. Everybody, right. it's everybody for themselves out here, man. Right. right. You know how I know everybody for themselves? Bring it up. Because when something go down, guess what the black and uh, uh, guess what the black the black or Latin man do? Come on. They pull out their phone and start filming. Right. That's and, right. Instead of helping, they pull the phone out. They say, oh look. And it's true because guess what? A man raped a woman on the on the train and uh off of 60, was it 69th? 69th. It was 69th Street up in dark. SEPTA is asking people to step up, saying people need to speak up when they see a crime happening in front of them. I'm Shayna Humphreys. I'm Jason Martinez, and this is all in response to the recent rape of a woman on the Market Frankfurt line. Our Jeff Cole live in Upper Darby tonight. Jeff. Yeah, Jason, we've talked to investigators who say, in point of fact, while this woman was being attacked, there were passengers on the train. They did apparently witness what was going on and apparently did nothing about it. Man raped this woman on the train. Guess what? Everybody watch. Because everybody for self, man. That's right. Bring it out. Because we don't respect one another. That's right. What is the nation? Nation is family. Nation is community. Nation is men leading by example. Nation is women's support. Nation.